Once I bulldoze this, we'll be able to open the new... Ooh, wonderful! It's lunchtime! Hi, Dharma. Can you grab my lunch for me? It's just on the table over there. Here you go! Catch! Goodness me! My bulldozer ate my lunch! I can't very well finish the last job of the whole project with a messy bulldozer. I'll need to head over to Carl's Car Wash right away. Oh, I'm tired of pushing dirt. I don't even remember why I'm doing it. <laughs> Could that be? Hi, Carl. Bolton? From the construction site? <gasps> Looks like you're almost done over there. <laughs> what are you building? I can't figure it out. Unfortunately, I can't tell you, Carl. It's top secret. Oh, man. It's driving me crazy. I gotta know. Well, lucky for you, it's almost opening day. Make sure to stop by and see it. Oh, I will! I will! <clears throat> Excuse me. What I meant to say was, how may I help you? As you can see, I'm sitting in filth. I do see. You've come to the right place. Okay, now, let's get started. What kind of vehicle are you driving? Is the vehicle a bulldozer, a digger, or a cement mixer? That's it! A bulldozer! Now, let's see how messy it is. Is it a little messy, medium messy, or super duper messy? say it's a little messy. <laughs> Let me see what kind of mess this is. Hmm, that actually smells pretty yummy. <laughs> that reminds me, I'm hungry. Is it funky smelling fungus? A peanut butter and jelly sandwich? Or stinky sardines? Ugh. That's it! It's a nice, sticky peanut butter and jelly sandwich. And finally, what size is this vehicle? Is it normal sized? Or is it big? Oh, it's big, all right. Incredible! That'll be 11 tokens, Bolton. Fantastic! I'll do some fancy math and drop them in by fives. Five. Ten. Plus one more equals 11. I'm heading in.
can't tell you how much better I look and feel. Terrific! <laughs> well, thanks for coming. No problem. Enjoy pushing that dirt around. Are you making a garden? Wish I could tell you, Bolton, but it's top secret. <laughs> okay, Carl. See you at the opening day. Bye! <laughs> Step right up, step right up, and ride the ricketyest, rockiest roller coaster to ever loop the loop in the land. Why, I tell you, I've seen grown adults the size of two men run for the hills just from the sight of these swoops and swirls. Only the bravest and boldest dare ride this roller coaster for the low, low cost of one ride ticket. Whoa, that sounds awesome. Let's do it. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yay! Oh no! The kids coated my coaster with their colorful carnival candy. I really have to rethink my riding with candy policy. But first, I got to get this coaster cleaned up at Carl's Car Wash. Still fun! Where did that come from? Rodney? From the carnival? Carl! Calamity! Catastrophe! A candy crisis of critical condition! Uh... Cleaning? Confirmed! <laughs> Can do! Let's get started. What kind of vehicle are you driving? Is the vehicle a train, a roller coaster, or a mining cart? That's it! It's a roller coaster! Now, let's see how messy this roller coaster is. Is it a little messy? Medium messy? or super duper messy. I'd say it's medium messy. Looks like candy to me, but what kind of candy makes up this mess? It's fluffy, crunchy, and sticky. Ugh. Is it Halloween candy? Christmas candy, or carnival candy. It's conclusively carnival candy. And finally, what size is this vehicle? Is it normal sized, or is it big? That's one long coaster. So I'd say it's big. Whoa! Now that is a slick sight to be seen. That'll be 25 tokens, Rodney. For only 25 tokens, I can win a wash. I'll up my odds by dropping them in by fives. Five. Ten. Fifteen. Twenty. Twenty-five. This is gonna be fun. for that cotton candy. That popcorn pops right off. Whoa! 
Look at me, loop de loop. There's a stomach turning twist if I've ever seen one. A candy apple today can go away. up, Carl, and gaze upon the cleanest coaster to curve around corners, climb colossal heights, and come careening down like a corkscrew. In fact, you should come to the carnival and give it a ride. Thanks, Rodney. But I don't think big, scary rides are for me. Besides, I have all the excitement I need right here. Suit yourself, Carl. So long. Exciting. <laughs> ah, just me and the open road. Oops, I can't cross over this fresh asphalt. Better turn around. Watch out, runaway steamroller! What in tarnation? Catch that Oh, man. gosh! I better head over to that Carl's Car Wash. I heard he's the best in the biz. Oh, who's that? Hey, Carl, I'm Bubba, and I've got trouble. Oh, boy, Bubba. It's bad. That's what I thought. Can you get it off? You bet. Okay, let's see. What kind of vehicle are you driving? Is it a digger? A big rig? Or a cement mixer? That's it. It's a big rig. Let's see how messy it is. Is it a little messy, medium messy, or super duper messy? Well, I'd say it's medium messy. Now, let's see what type of mess this is. Well, it's hot, sticky, and still steaming. Is it lots of leaves, fishy fish, or tacky tar? <laughs> it's totally tacky tar. And finally, what size is this vehicle? Is it normal sized? Or is it big? Well, big is in its name. So this vehicle is definitely big. Well, I'll be. That'll be 15 tokens, Bubba. Not a problem. I'll give them to you five at a time. Five. Ten. Fifteen. It's time to get you gussied up, Big Rig.
Josh took the tacky tar right off my truck. Gotta thank you big time, Carl. You're welcome, Bubba. Uh. 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 Oh, right back at ya. And come back soon, big guy. Let's see who's got mail. Aha, you've got mail. Why, hello, Bailey Boo. Are you here for the mail? Your family has a lot of mail today, don't they? Yes, they do. Yes, they do. <laughs> oh, oh no. Look at those paw prints. Sit, Bailey Boo. Down. I've got the mail. Over here. Here you go. Come on. Good boy. Open. <sighs> now, what can I do about all these paw prints? I can't bring my mail truck back to the post office looking like this. I've got it. I'll drive to Carl's Car Wash. Yet. I wonder when it's getting here. I guess now. G'day, Carl. How are you? Great. I was hoping you'd stop by with your mail truck, Amelia. I'm waiting for a package. Ah, here it is. Oh, thanks. You're welcome. Now, Carl. I've got a messy problem with my truck. <laughs> did Bailey Boo do that? Yep, he sure did. Can you wash it off? You know I can. Let me find your vehicle. Is it a fan boat? A mail truck? Or a police car? That's it, a mail truck. Let's see how messy this mail truck is. Is it a little messy? Medium messy? Or super duper messy? I'd say it's a little messy. Now, let's see what kind of mess this is. Someone was awfully excited to see this mail truck. <laughs> Even more excited than me. Is it peanut butter? Muddy paw prints? Or a leftover chicken salad? I'm positive it's the muddy paw prints. <laughs> and finally, what size is this vehicle? Is it normal sized? Or is it big? Mm, it's normal sized. That'll be eight tokens, Amelia. No problem. I'll count by twos. Two, four, six, eight tokens. Here we go.
mail truck looks better than ever. Now I can bring it back to the post office all clean. Thank you so much, Carl. You're welcome, Amelia! Now, let's see what I got. Soap for my bubble bath. <gasps> Time for an extra long and bubbly lunch break! Sure do miss the ducks at this here duck pond now that they've flown south for the winter. But this statue will be a good reminder that they'll be back in the springtime. Almost. Gotcha. Easy. Easy does it. marks the spot. Oh, no! Whoa! The snow is too slippery! Maybe ducks can float on water, but duck statues can't. <sighs> Looks like I'm not done with the claw crane just yet. But this is it. Oh! My claw is frozen. I've got to get rid of this ice. I wonder if Carl at Carl's Car Wash can help me. I have a feeling he has a few tricks up his sleeve for these frosty winter months. <laughs> gotcha! Come on. Come on. Just a little farther. No, 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 no! Oh! I was so close! One more try. Oh, but it'll have to wait. I have a customer. I'll be back for you. Hi there. Uh, I'm Carl. Uh, what brings you to my car wash on such a chilly day? Hi, Carl. Hi, I'm Coletta. I was placing the new duck statue at the duck pond, but after a slippery situation, my claw got frozen in the water. Can you help me melt this ice? Hmm. I glaze sure can. <laughs> Let's get started. What kind of vehicle are you driving? Is the vehicle... A crane truck, a digger, or a snowplow. That's it! It's a crane truck! Now let me change my car wash settings from messy to temperature. Should I make my car wash cold, warm, or hot? It should definitely be set to hot if I'm going to melt that ice. Whew. And finally, what size is this vehicle? Is it normal sized or is it big? <laughs> it's big, all right. will be 21 tokens, Coletta. Thanks. I'll pay by threes. Three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18, 101. Things are heating up.
my crane claw unfrozen, I can try to get that duck statue out of the pond. I heard it'll be a warmer day tomorrow, so hopefully the pond water won't be as icy. That's good to know. Maybe I'll wait until then. See you, Carl. All right, I got you this time. Yes! Yes! Huh, and it's a grumble, too. Two more to go. I tussled with a chicken coop and lost. What a mess. I gotta get to Carl's car wash quick as a jackrabbit who is late for supper. Oh, this fan is small. But it's got a lot of power. Howdy there, Carl. I got myself in a lick of trouble again. <laughs> Another swamp mess, Horace? Hey, I got me a need for speed, Carl. I got it in me. I cannot help it. So how's about getting my hovercraft all gussied up for me again, Carl? <sighs> all right. Let's get started. Is the vehicle a car, helicopter, or hovercraft? That's it! It's a hovercraft! Let's see how messy it is. Is it a little messy, medium messy, or super duper messy? say it's a little messy. Let me see what kind of mess this is. <laughs> oh! <laughs> that never gets old. Is it pea soup? Dirt? or swamp grass and feathers. That's it, swamp grass and feathers. And finally, what size is this vehicle? Is it normal sized or is it big? Uh, it's normal sized. That'll be five tokens, Horace. What? Two, three, four, and five. Woo! Let's get her done.
See you tomorrow, Horace. <laughs> Oh dear, 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 oh dear. Oh, hello there. Welcome to Carl's Car Wash. I'm Carl. Carl, thank goodness you're here. We need your help. Uh, we? Yes, let us introduce ourselves. I'm Howard, the happy clown. I find joy in jokes and everything. <laughs> Except for right now. I got a bit of the old frazzle-dazzle. I'm Nellie, the nervous clown. I second-guess everything and I worry an awful lot. <laughs> I'm Arnita, the grumpy clown. I get so grumpy that I like to throw things. And I am Vincent Bartholomew Puddington III. And what do you do, Vincent? I majored in English literature and hold doctorates in theoretical physics and quantum mechanics. And yes, honk honk. Carl, our car is in a bad state, let me tell you. It's a banana bonanza, a green calamity, a pie, um... Predicament. Oh yeah, what he said, a producta bug. <laughs> We were rehearsing our big act for the last day of the carnival, but one thing led to another, and... <laughs> pie! Pie everywhere! Who ever heard of a clown car covered in pie? We'll be the laughing stock of the whole carnival. So, Carl, old buddy, old pal, I come here to you with hat in hand. Oh, sorry. That was supposed to be a figure of speech. I just couldn't help myself. <laughs> Whoops. What we're trying to say is... Can, can you help, help us get, get cleaned, cleaned up? up? The man runs a car wash, so one may assume... Of course I can help. See? Let's get started. What kind of vehicle are you driving? Is the vehicle a clown car, a golf cart, or a quadricycle? That's it! It's a clown car! Sorry. Now, let's see how messy this clown car is. Is it a little messy, medium messy, or super duper messy? I'd say it's super duper messy. Huh. I know this mess is a pie, but there are lots of different kinds of pie. Let me see what kind of pie it is. Hmm. It's creamy, and it has slices of soft white fruit. Is it key lime pie? Banana cream pie? Or apple crumble pie? You betcha! It's banana cream pie! And finally, what size is this vehicle? Is it normal sized? Or is it big? Wow! That might just be the smallest vehicle I've ever cleaned. I don't even have a setting for small. But it should work if I choose normal sized. That'll be one token, Howard, Nellie, Arnita, and Vincent. I don't have a token. What's a oh, token? I haven't seen a token in my life. Nellie, why did you buy the cotton candy? I'm short of token, oh, exactly one. I don't have a token. I don't have a token. <sighs> One. All aboard!
the bubbles, everyone. One, two, too many. <laughs> in here, indoors? I forgot my umbrella. <laughs> Do you feel that breeze? It's a little drafty in here. Look at that shine! <laughs> Carl, you've gone and done it! This clown car is cleaner than apples in a barrel with a sign on it that says bobbing for apples! And no one has bobbed for an apple in a while, so the apples have just been in the water and are very clean apples! That's what this car is! <laughs> Say! How'd you like to come and see our big act? It's the last day of the carnival, after all, and we want to send her up in style! Oh, I would love to join you, but I don't think there's enough room for me in your clown car. Oh, don't be silly. There's plenty of room. We just have to take out the grand piano, the fine china, the other grand piano, and the grand piano. See? Plenty of room. You can even sit next to the spare grand piano. <laughs> Whoa! Seat belts, everyone! <laughs> and now for the big act, which I'm certain you are all highly enthused to witness. Sure seems like a bad idea. <laughs> Why do I even bother cleaning sometimes? <laughs> Right, Agent Bob, this is the spot where people have reported seeing aliens. Ha! <laughs> aliens. You don't believe in aliens, Agent Bob? No, Agent Babs, I don't. There's no such thing as little green things with beebly bobbly antenna bouncing around. Well, I think there's something out there. We are not alone. I'll believe it when I see it. If there's alien life form out there, and there is, our telescope will see it. Let's check the monitors. We're looking into deep space now. Keep your eyes peeled for aliens, Martians, and UFOs. Okay, but I really don't think we'll see anything. Wait, what is that? Oh, I think we just found... a butterfly. Shoo, shoo, butterfly! We're blocking our view. Here. I'll move it. Shoo! We'll never be able to see aliens if you're covering the telescope! 
Shoot! Shoot! Ah, silly humans! They'll never see me! Whoops! Ah, what's this? Oh, it's all over our high-tech secret agent car! We've got to get this cleaned up before we miss the aliens! I know exactly where to go. Carl's Car Wash. I'm gonna need a lot of sunblock where I'm going. Hello? Are you Carl? Of Carl's Car Wash? Yes? What can I do for you? We're Special Agent Bob and Babs. We're on a top secret mission looking for alien. Agent Bob? Shh. Carl, we need your help. We have an unknown chemical compound obscuring our surveillance equipment and need to get cleaned up ASAP. Can you help us? Of course. Say no more. Let me find your vehicle. Is it a hang glider, a crane, or a high-tech secret agent car? <laughs> That's it. A high-tech secret agent car. Let's see how messy your secret agent car is. Is it a little messy? Medium messy? Or super duper messy? I'd say it's medium messy. Now, let's see what kind of mess we're dealing with. Interesting. Uh, I've encountered this particular substance before. You have? Sure. I order it every time I have a hamburger. Is it meaty meatballs? Strawberry milkshake? Or gooey glue? Yep, it's strawberry milkshake. Yummy. Now, what size is this vehicle? Is it normal sized? Or is it big? It's normal sized. That'll be 12 tokens, Agent Babs and Agent Bob. Here. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. There, twelve tokens. Commence Operation Car Wash.
we can continue our undercover secret mission and see if there's alien life out there after all. Agent Babs! Shh! Oops! Uh, forget everything I just said, Carl. <laughs> Aliens don't exist. Go about your business. They don't? Uh, but I know an alien. They don't. And we were never here. Never here. train and get rid of the smell. Time to choo 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 over there. I've been working at the car wash all the live long. Hey! Train tracks? Going through my car wash? Hey there! You must be Carl! I'm Trey, the train engineer. Oh, it's nice to meet you, Trey. Uh, what's with all the train tracks? Well, I hope you don't mind. I had to put down these tracks because I have a tricky, sticky train mess. And I needed some way to get my train into your car wash. Of course, of course. <laughs> Makes sense. Uh, do you need any more help with the tracks? Nope. I'm all done. I just need to pull my train around. Whoa! Trey, your train is messy. I know, Carl. And this strong smell is making me sneeze. Achoo! You can't drive like that. Let me help you. First, let me find your vehicle. Is it a train, a wagon, or a snowmobile? That's it, a train. Let's see how messy this train is. Is it a little messy? Medium messy? Or super duper messy? Hmm, it's medium messy. Now, let's see what kind of mess we're dealing with. Sticky. Ooh, smells fresh. <laughs> but it really smells. It sticks in your nose. 
Is it dirty socks, spilt orange juice, or sappy pine cones? That's it! <laughs> sappy pine cones. Now, what size is this vehicle? Is it normal sized? Or is it big? Oh, that's definitely big! That'll be 13 tokens, Trey. Woo-wee! I've got it right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. All aboard! Next stop, Clean Town. <laughs> much for cleaning my train. It looks terrific and uh, I can breathe without sneezing. <gasps> Great! I'm glad to see that. Well, I'd better get going. I'm running late. Maybe I'll see you on my return trip, Carl. Bye, train. See ya. Now, what am I going to do with all these tracks? No? Anyone got a train? Chug on over to Carl's Train Wash. One day special. <laughs> I've been working at the train wash all the live long day. 